How to create gingerbread man Change the stroke color to none Click this fill layer Use rectangle tool Create a square Go to the swatches panel Choose a color Press command to lock the object Use ellipse tool Go to the swatches panel Change color to white Hold the shift key Create a circle Use rectangle tool Create a rectangle here Create two more rectangles Use selection tool Adjust the size and position Select this one Move here Adjust the angle Select this one Adjust the angle Move here Adjust the size And this one Alright Hold the shift key Select these three shapes Press command C then command F Right click select transform then click reflect OK Move here Select and delete this white rectangle Select the circle Adjust the position Alright Select this one Use direct selection tool Change the shape to trapezoid Alright Use selection tool Select all Hold the option key duplicate and put here Select these objects Go to Pathfinder panel and click Unite Use Direct Selection tool Select this corner Drag the live corner to be rounded Double click the corner point Set radius number to 4 Select this corner Drag the live corner to be rounded Double click the corner point Set radius number to 2 same action here Alright Select these anchor points Drag the live corner to be rounded Same action here Alright Use selection tool Select the gingerbread man Adjust the size Go to align panel click horizontal align center Click vertical align center Go to the swatches panel Change color to deep brown Press command C then command F Swap fill and stroke Change the stroke color to white Go to effect select path click offset path Click preview Adjust the setting like this OK Go to the stroke panel Change the weight to 4 points Alright Use pen tool Draw a line here here Go to effect select distort and transform Click zigzag Click preview Adjust the setting like this Ok Select this stroke Same action here Okay. 
Select the stroke. Hold the option key duplicate it. Adjust the position. Alright. Go to the stroke panel. Change the weight to two points. Adjust the two lines a little bit closer. Alright. Then the other line. Same action here. Alright. Hold the shift key. Select all the white lines. Press Command C then Command F. Right click select transform then click reflect. Select and delete this one white line. Use ellipse tool. Swap fill and stroke. Create a circle. Press command option shift. Duplicate and move here. Create a circle here. Press command C then command F. Go to the swatches panel. Change color to red. Right click select transform then click scale. Adjust the size smaller. OK. Hold the shift key. Select these two circle. Press command D. Duplicate and move here. Press command D duplicate more. Select this one. Change color to green. Use pen tool. Click default fill and stroke color. Swap black and white color. Change the fill color to none. Draw a smile line. Go to the stroke panel. Change the weight to 3 points. Click round cap and round join. Change the weight to 5 points. Alright. Use rectangle tool. Create a rectangle here. Swap fill and stroke. Use direct selection tool. Change the shape to trapezoid. Like this. Hold the shift key. Select these two live corners. Drag the live corner to be rounded. Use selection tool. Press command C then command F. Right click select transform then click reflect. Move here. Hold the shift key. Select these two objects. Press command C then command F. Go to the swatches panel. Change color to green. Go to effect select path click offset path. Click preview. Change the offset number. OK. Use direct selection tool. Hold the shift key. Select these two live corners. Drag the live corner to be rounded. Alright. Use rectangle tool. Create a rectangle here. Go to the swatches panel. Change color to red. Drag the live corners to the center. Use selection tool. Select the gingerbread man. Press command to lock the object. Select all these objects. Press command G group it all. Go to object click expand appearance. Adjust the size bigger. Select all these objects. Move a little bit downward. The size of the bow tie look like a bit over. Adjust the size smaller. All right. Go to object click unlock all. Select the background color. Press command to lock the object. Select the gingerbread man. Press command C then command F. Change color to deep brown. Bring to front. Move here. Move a little bit upward. Adjust the size. Select the gingerbread man of the white line. Go to object click expand appearance. Hold the shift key. Select these two objects. Hold the option key duplicate it. Use shape builder tool. Hold the option key delete these areas. Use selection tool. Select and delete this one. Select this shape. Move here. 
change color to deep brown. Select the white stroke. Bring to front. Select this shape. Adjust the position. OK. Select and delete these objects. Select this white circle. Move here. Bring to front. Adjust the size a little bit bigger. Hold the Option key duplicate it. Hold the Shift key and select this one. Swap Fill and Stroke. Select this one. Adjust the size bigger. Hold the Shift key and select this one. Use Shape Builder tool. Hold Option key delete these area. Use Eyedropper tool. Select this color. Use Selection tool. Select the white stroke. Bring to front. Select this object. Bring to front. Select these two strokes. Bring to front. Use Pen tool. Draw a regular shape. Like this. Alright. Use Selection tool. Swap Fill and Stroke. Hold the Shift key. Select the Gingerbread Man. Use Shape Builder tool. Hold the Option key delete these areas. Use Eyedropper tool. Select this color. Use Selection tool. Send to back. Hold the Shift key. Select these two strokes. Bring to front. Select the Gingerbread Man of the white line. Bring to front. Adjust the size. Adjust the position. Adjust the size again. Alright. Press Command C then Command F. Right click select transform then click reflect. Move here. Hold the shift key. Select these two strokes. Bring to front. Select this shape. Move here. Alright. Final adjust the shadow position. Alright. Select the gingerbread man. Go to color panel. Adjust the brown color a bit lighter. OK. Select the gingerbread man. Press Command C then Command F. Press Command 2 lock the object. Select the gingerbread man. Go to the swatches panel. Change color to black. Adjust the position. Go to effect select blur then click Gaussian blur. Click preview. Adjust the radius pixels like this. OK. Go to transparency panel. Select multiple. Adjust the opacity number. Adjust the position. Perfect. Now we got a gingerbread man. Thank you for watching and see you soon for another video.